Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new reaction, as you can tell by the title, it's another Jacksepticeye video, and it's another scary games video that Jack decided to do, and it's, it seems to me that another cryptic thing has been posted in this video, just like that weird ending, that's weird ending with the I thought we could be friends when he was like acting strange and stuff like that, and then he looked at the camera and just like lunch the camera stuff like that now it seems like he's at it again but then again it may never leave it may not leave for to anything for a while we're kind of used to this but it remains to be seen so anyways enough rambling let's get right into it so without further ado, uh, let's react to this video shall we my name is Jack Slept the Guy, and I am in a great mood today. I woke up early, I'm getting work done, I'm feeling very productive. So why let, let's not just crash that mood right down and play some scary games, shall we? I have tried to procure oh, the God. best, scariest, most delectable horror games for this today's episode. By which I mean I went to Itch.io and just picked some three random scary games that I thought looked interesting to my eyeballs. So welcome... First one is called TV Night. I don't know what a TV Midnight. night is. Mom and, dad are Mom and Dad are asleep. Time to go watch Time TV. Time to go watch TV. Oh! I never did this as a kid. People always say, like, oh, I woke up and I went to watch scary movies and Mom and Dad went to bed. I couldn't do that. My house was tiny and it was full of people, so if I went and watched TV, everyone would be like, hey! What the fuck up? Uh, ooh, a Nirvana poster. A poster of my favorite band. Smash, Smash Mouth. Mouth. <laughs> All right, that's Somebody awesome. once told me so the world was going to roll me. My stereo. It's awesome. Is that where you listen to all your Smash Mouth? All right, what else Rock we got? Star. We got a... Jesus Christ. Are you two feet tall? <laughs> all right, same. I mean, when I was a kid, I was two feet tall as well. I was... I know people make fun of me for being short now, which I'm not. I'm perfectly average size, you motherfuckers. They make fun of Mark for being short, too. I was tiny. I was like a speck of sand in the middle of a beach. I'm going this way instead. I'm going to wake up my parents. I don't want to wake up my parents. Okay, I'm not going to go do that. I'm going to do the opposite of that. I'm going to knock over a vase. It's unbearably quiet. I don't know if there actually is supposed to be audio. They left the TV on. They left the TV on? No, they didn't. That's a spooky scares, probably. It's probably some sort of ghost man. Okay, so the TV's making noise. Very, very faintly, I might add. And I have, like, I have my headphones cranked. Maybe not a good idea. I don't want to go out. Why not? Why not? There is no line. Alright, let's just watch TV then and get scared. Well, All channels good. show static. I better check the back. Oh. There's a VHS tape stuck to the back of the TV. That's not where they go. Oh boy, is this rings? Hey! What kind of cartoon, cartoon is, this? is this? Oh my god! Find oh, my tapes. tapes. But it's just my mom trying to scare me. Do you think your mom would be that elaborate? Another that tape in the garage. Much. Okay. That cartoon looked exactly like a cartoon that I remember from my childhood that I cannot find anywhere. Well, I used to have a VHS tape at home of a bunch of different cartoons. I don't know if they were Disney or Bootleg or Counterfeit or Irish knockoffs or what. I'm pretty sure they were legit. But fucking one of them had a guy on a train and he was bouncing along the track and he was trying to oil it and everything. And I think he might have been a cow... I don't know, and I can't for the life of me fucking remember what that cartoon was, but I really need to find it. It's going to drive me insane. And every now and then I see a cartoon that kind of looks like it. I don't know why I'm so upset about this, but... Oh, oh no. I do not like that. Oh, this fucking sucks. Can't see shit. This sucks every dick that was in the bag. Where's the garage? Right here. This is it. Yeah, that could help. Grab the flashlight. Yes, you should. Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
little boy. Okay. So far, so goodly. What's on this tape? Oh boy. Good job. Good job! At least I think that's what but it says. There's still more but there tapes are still to find. more tapes to find. Where's the next one? Storage room. That's right here. That's this one, right? That's my oh, stereo. No. Oh, should we go up and check it out? It's gonna wake up my parents and I'm gonna get in trouble! What? I know. You. I don't even know. It almost sounded like fuck, man. To me, it reminded me of I know you're awake. He whispered that ever so delicately in my ears. I'm gonna be, oh I'm gonna be surprised. Oh, if I don't was, like this. <laughs> I'm gonna be surprised if that was Jack's voice saying no, that. I'm home alone. Evelyn went back to the Netherlands for Christmas for a few days to see her family, and I'm alone in the house. BB's here somewhere. He's sleeping. He doesn't care. He's not scared of anything. He's, <laughs> He's immune. I'm stuck in my house alone, in broad daylight, afraid that someone's going to jump through my window and kill me. Which is a legit fear. Oh boy. Especially if someone comes up and says, I know. You're Don't, be Don't be afraid. Oh, easier said than done when you have, uh, when your you have to shit your pants. having a hell of a time. That's my room. That's my room. I don't want to go back up there. Fuck is making that noise. Oh no. Um. <laughs> Did you see that? I saw that TV, TV static. Legs. I didn't see that. I just That's saw scary. a static image. A sta like I saw a TV static. Go? I didn't see anything because it's so dark. Fuck. Oh no. The Smash Mouth poster. No, my Smash Mouth poster! <gasps> so oh, it fucking sucks! Auntie. I don't have to be afraid of my TV! TV was the place I went to get away from people. And I was already afraid of people. I don't have to be afraid of my TV as well. Fuck this. Almost, Almost there. there. Almost dead time. I've been very, I'm I'm very, very, very close. Very close. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck! Get off me, stranger! Oh, dickhead. <laughs> you don't hear a lot of dickhead anymore, do you? Dickhead and shithead went out the window, but I like them. They're good old-fashioned insults. I can see him, though. He's, like... It's not even plugged in. What's going on? The tape is there, but th those are his legs! Someone's knocking on the door. Someone's knocking on the door. Wait, which door? Which door? Oh, it's downstairs. Okay. I want to get spooked as much as I possibly can. Hello, neighbors! Are you here to save me? Can't I can't open it. I can only look through the peephole. Oh, boy. The oh, fuck? <laughs> that was that was silly. <laughs> that, that 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 one didn't scare me. I'm fine with that one. <laughs> <laughs> Just sounds like me when I'm yawning. Mommers, dadders, it's your sweet baby boy Sean. Where are mom and dad? Where are mom and dad? They're fucking dead, Sylvia. They're done. <laughs> Jesus oh no! Christ. Grab the tape and go! Just grab the tape and fucking go! Just eat the fucking tape! Don't watch it! Just eat the tape! Put it in your belly! Eat the fucking thing! This sucks, this sucks, this sucks. Watch the last tape and just get it over with. What I like. What I like the most, the most about, about you. you. Uh oh. Oh, fuck! Is that nothing, Is that nothing will, will stop, stop you? you? Holy shit. Did my TV just kill me? Oh, 
Alfonso. Damn it, the, the, the news was right. Video games and TV and movies cause violence. Mainly because my TV comes alive and kills me. That was fun. I like yeah, that. Yeah, that was, Simple, the concept was inventive. Cool. It was just to go collect all these types of things again, like a Slenderman type of game. But the fact that my TV was alive and grew legs and killed me, that was pretty unique. I had never seen that before. I like that a lot. I also like the idea of the TV itself being the thing that you interact with to see where the tapes are, and then the TV itself comes alive and eats you. That's fucking cool. However, now every time I watch TV, I'm going to have to be like, are there arms coming out of that? Are there, uh, are those legs? It's just yeah. cables coming out of the bottom of my TV, but I'm watching you. Hey. This, uh, we're right into this one. Oh, this music's awesome. old 80s horror movie. This one's called One Got in the House. Uh, so it's like a point and click type of thing. Let's upstairs all the way turn around. The music kind of sounds like Metroid Fusion a little bit. Oh god. Oh no. To me. I don't like this. This is creepy. Slightly. Wait. What am I waiting? Okay. Slow down. <laughs> I only just got here. Who's on? My god! This feels like I went to the bathroom, pulled out my pants, and before I even sat in the toilet, my ass was just like, Oh, get out of me! Fucking sucked. Okay. I turned around here, and that's what got me killed. So let's go stairs. Let's go down. Door? I'm about to punch a child. Oh god. Living room? Wait. Everyone is missing. Okay. Am I just going to have to hope for the best on this one? I don't know what I'm waiting for. I don't even know where I am anymore! <laughs> what a little shitbag. Okay, let's go forward. Dining. Uh, let's go to the window. Oh! Okay, that, that's the door that kills me, right? Oh god, this is so creepy looking! Oh, it's spooky! Where am I? Wait! Just wait all day! The evil is gone, you survived! <laughs> to do I don't know fuck off guys the evil got me and I fucking died again I don't know what I should be doing other than this what's the point of the game can I really just wait I clicked wait and it still killed me so me clicking wait all those other times, I actually survived and won. That's it. I'm calling that a win. That is the quickest I have ever defeated the evil inside my house. I'm a fucking genius. Okay, so real quick, that, that game was really short, and I actually did quite like it a lot. I like the, that sort of style, that black and white like house. Like It's really creepy looking. It's just looking upstairs or looking downstairs. It, just, it gives me the heebie-jeebies. I don't like it. It freaks me out, and that's cool. And the scare was good, it got me the very first time, whatnot. But I did see after that on their Itch.io page, it does, it does say, please donate, it helps me pay bills while my family fights the real world horror called cancer. Oh. Plus I will make longer, even scarier games. So I'm gonna take this opportunity, take this platform and take this responsibility and this audience that we have here to push you guys towards this. Uh, it's called One Got In The House. Um, there'll be a link in the description for it. Go help them out, spread some joy, spread some love, because going through the fight against cancer 
is one of the scariest, hardest, most traumatic things that a family or person has to go through. So give, spread some love. Uh, this is the, the time of giving in December and we're coming up towards Christmas. And that's a hard time for a lot of people, especially if they have to go through something like this. So please go and just help them out and donate if you can, because no, no one should have to go through that. No. And that's sad. And they made a cool game and I've, I feel like it would be remiss of me to play the game here on the channel and not, like, do something for them. So last on our list hey. for today is a game called Error Number 54. Now, I like the look of this already because it's got a Zando type recently. of text, which I'm very, very fond of. And it also has glitches and errors and all that kind of stuff, which, as you know, I'm also very, very fond of. So let's give this yeah. a shot and let's see what it's all about. Ironically enough. Dude, I'm rocking like 600 FPS on this game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, boy, I just heard the pedals. Spooky? Oh, Jesus, okay. That actually did scare me. Now the frame rate just dropped. Hi, buddy! Oh, are we entering the mind of a psychopath? Probably. Probably anti. Not really. We're actually just a camera resting on top of his head. <laughs> so that's nice. Damn, this game looks great. I think that's why another reason why I picked it. Grab the flashlight. Okay. Gee. Add item to inventory. Nice! We have a flashlight! Open door! That's how I open. Use the fork. Bet all my doors. Hello? God, that is some really loud ass rain. Actually, it was pissing rain here like 20 minutes ago, and now it's totally fine. What the heck? Radio. Can I? Can I? Oh god, it's so loud! Can I shut you off? I don't like loud sounds all around me. I know, ironic. <laughs> but especially in a scenario like this, if I was in a scary scenario, I would be the quietest person on the planet. But this is not real life, this is a video game and everything's very loud. Hello? Oh, we're in for a PT situation. Oh my god, it is PT! Oh uh, yeah. PT has the rain outside the window and it has the radio and everything. That's all backwards so though. Okay. I'm into it, I see what you're putting down, and I might even pick it up. I have, these are some squeaky ass floorboards. See, I don't like when the radio's loud because I can't hear other things that are going on that are going to scare me. Oh shit. Fuck me. It's a lantern. Okay. I have a lantern now. I always wanted one of those. And Christmas is right around the corner. Cybercrime! The latest news for today, a dangerous virus has rapidly captured hundreds of thousands of devices around the world. American telecommunications company, Jane Freak, has warned users about the active spreading of malicious software called Number 54. Execute Order 66. <laughs> the virus has infected hundreds of thousands of computers and this number is growing exponentially. Information security experts claim the virus collects all possible information about the user and transmits it to the creator. London and Washington accuse Russia of spreading the virus. Okay. Mouse 1 to continue. I'm pressing mouse 1 and nothing's happening. Okay, there we go. Use the broken lantern on this. Oh, dude, I have feet! Sick! I fucking love feet, dude! Wiki feet? That's my jam. Got a bookmark. Oh god. Oh, All right. Boy. Well, my distrust for this game has never been higher, and it only grows with time. All right, a light broke that time. That's not so bad. I can handle a light breaking. But if people start showing up standing in the middle of hallways just like PT, I don't know. I don't have to back. Oh, okay. <laughs> the fuck out there, dude. Are you okay? You need an inhaler or something? 
fuck. Can't see. And the radio is playing. Okay. And now the door is open. Howdy! God, this feels like playing some old school indie horror games, man. Keys. keys. Sweet. Are they the keys to my heart? Shit. Wait, how do I open my inventory? Hi? Oh no. Uh, no one's home. Occupied! Housekeeping. Who is there? Who goes there? <laughs> Someone wants to sell me something. I'm not afraid! I'm very afraid! Oh man, you knocked over the radio. The radio's down. Okay, I'm starting to feel real uneasy now. Now I'm legit getting paranoid. Did you hear rumblies? Radio's gone. Can fucking stop that. You're scarier than anything this game is throwing at me. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Why is my alarm going off? Scared the shit out of me as well. In the city of Portland, residents reported the loss of a well-known video blogger having on the channel more than 100,000 subscribers. On the channel, Blogger shared how to fix various system errors and get rid of viruses. It is known that the Blogger at the time of the kidnapping was at home and filmed another video tutorial and even managed to save the file called How to Fix Number 654 System Error. The search has already begun. Oh boy. Okay, how do I... Oh, it's mouse two to get out of it, not mouse one. Oh shit. Oh boy. Why, 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 why? Just go. Just go. Just go. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Just fucking go. Fuck! It's too loud! <laughs> I can't handle it! It's overload! Turn the volume down. Oh fuck. Um... Uh, what? Don't do this to me! Whoa. It was a fake wall! That's awesome! Jesus, the rooms are getting smaller, boys. That one just said, why? Why indeed? I would like to know as well. Why am I here? Why am I? Who am I? Oh boy, we got oh, something new. Is... Hello. Fuck. Fuck. Oh no. Fuck. Oh no. Fuck! Oh, that one wasn't so bad. Fuck! <laughs> I know this is where this is going. Thank you! Thank you! Oh great, now we have red lights here. This is even the same thing as BT where the place goes red after a while. Fuck that radio, man! Too loud! Music these days, I don't know what kids are listening to. <gasps> Jesus fucking Christ, okay! <laughs> I don't know why I didn't turn off my flashlight. Maybe I got so scared in my... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Which is gonna knock down? Chair? Okay. 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 You got this. You got this. You're a big boy. You got big boy balls. You pay your taxes. You're a big lad. Just go. Oh, God. Look behind, Look behind you. you. I don't want to. Oh, hell no. Please, no. Oh. Oh, great. Y'all got any more of those fake walls? 
every now and then he's just like, oh, I'm fine, and then... <sighs> the deepest breath a man has ever taken. Okay. Oh, God. I'm gonna have a fucking heart attack, man. You wanna play? What about hide and seek? You're hitting! <laughs> Actually, you're hitting! <laughs> Oh god, what the oh. fuck are you? Oh god! Run! No 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 Don't do this to me! No, not one of these! Not one of these! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Okay. Thank you for clearing that out of the way. Cybercrime, the latest news for today. Epidemic of dangerous computer virus. Uh, moves to a new level. Yesterday, the virus named number 54 seized all electronic billboards in Tokyo and demonstrated the startling inscription, You are next. Uh, sorry, I had a little burp in me. Is that what was next? To save the city from this inscription, could only one way. Power off. Okay. The damage caused by the most massive cyber attack is estimated at tens of millions of dollars. The city authorities are furious. I don't know, man. I'd, I'd be pretty scared. Am I the virus? Oh, fucking duty. Oh, fuck. Now we gotta, we're trapped in this maze. It's a loop. Why did I decide to put myself into a perilous situation that I cannot get out of? Can I go the same way again? Nope. That's blocked. How about this way? Oh, that's fucking blocked. That's blocked. Everything's fucking blocked. It might as well be Minecraft. Fucking blocked. Block it. No, block it. That's it. No, block it. Block it. Block it. Block it. Block it. Block it. Sean McLaughlin. <laughs> More like Sean McBlocked in. Oh, good lord. That's, that's a good one. I'm gonna go back the way I came. That's the solution. I figured it out. This is not the way I came, but now I'm just trying this. Hey! I figured it out. Don't go back the way you came. Excuse me. Very rude. Slamming my doors. What is this? A fucking Uber? The number 54 virus is the biggest threat to the global economy. Over the past two days, hundreds of millions of people have complained about their banks for stolen money and completely zeroed out cash accounts. The damage is estimated at more than $10 billion. As strange as it may sound, many now do not advise to use the internet at all because of number 54. Fucking 54, man. Ruining us all. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That weird, freaky... Dude isn't gonna show up again, is he? Leave this place. Leave this place? How? Uh, it's not for lack of trying. I really fucking want to leave this place, but I can't. a lot there. Okay, is this the same one again? Yes. Okay, try this. Try this. Try that. Leave this place. Get the keys. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, on to phase two.
Well then. So after all of my efforts to go through all of that, listening to so much rain coming out of the left, left, left window, and listen to that radio, still got the virus. That's what I get for looking at feet on the internet. I always get a virus. So let that be a lesson to you. Be careful what you're doing on the internet. Be careful what you're giving attention to, and be careful where you're looking. Because you never know what's out there. You never know what's going to come for you in the deepest, darkest depths of your mind. But those are some really cool games. I like them a lot. I always like doing these types of videos because it shows off different types of horror games and what people are doing. And so this was on HEO in general, Whoa. which is just a really cool website for a lot of cool games. So I leave just links in the descriptions for all of these that you can go off and play them for yourselves. Uh -oh. Until next time, bye-bye. <laughs>
in that in that game, but the second game was too short. But then again, we understand why because a lot of personal stuff going on with him and his family. But then the third game, area error. I kept saying I was about to. I keep saying area error fifty four, which I heard Mark played as well, but I didn't. I think it was the video that he posted very or very late in, at night, <laughs> like at 2 in the morning for me. He posted that video. I'm like, why are you posting videos this late? So I guess that was the video he posted. I didn't watch it because I got a lot of videos to watch from Mark, and it involves scary games. I might also watch the Decade, a Decade of Jacksepticeye video as well, just to see what he, what he has to say about what he has done that past decade and stuff. I might watch that at some point, but also I might watch also the video he did for GTA 5, which I kind of promised before, but I still got to do. But anyways, I think I'll ra I've done rambled long enough, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's reaction. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the notification squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram because I make cool ads of Markiplier, Jack Guy, even myself. I also do reenactments and cosplays on there, so go check it out. Be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, JRDL96 signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!